Hi, this is Ryan from Foxtech, and today I'm going to walk you through how to record your iPad screen and camera at the same time. There are some limitations to what's possible on the iPad, but I'll show you a few ways to work around that and explain what your options are. To start with, if you're looking to record both the front and rear facing cameras at the same time, the iPad doesn't have a built-in feature for this. However, there are some third-party apps that allow you to do this. Apps like Double Take or Dualgram let you record from both cameras simultaneously, which is pretty useful if you're trying to capture multiple angles at once. Now, if you just want to record your screen, that's built right into the iPad. To get started, swipe down from the top right corner of your iPad to open the control center. You should see the screen recording button there. If you don't, go into your settings, open the control center section, and add the screen recording toggle. Once you've got it there, press and hold the button, and it will give you the option to start recording. Once your screen recording has started, you can open the camera app, and what you see through the camera will be included in the screen recording. This is useful if you're trying to show both your screen activity and a live view from your camera. To stop the recording, just tap the red status bar at the top of your screen, or go back into the control center and stop it from there. The video will be saved in your Photos app for you to review or edit later. Unfortunately, if you want to record the front-facing camera and the screen at the same time, that's not something the iPad can do natively. A workaround for this would be to record your screen and front camera separately, then layer the videos together in an editing app like CapCut or any other video editor that supports picture-in-picture -picture effects. For those looking for a more advanced solution, using a computer with software like Loom is a great option. Loom allows you to record your screen and camera at the same time, and it's extremely useful for creating tutorials or presentations. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like it and subscribe for more tech tips. See you later.